The school district in the Heartland adds a boost to its security measures for the upcoming football season. Ahmad Lathan shows us what that extra safety looks like at Sykeston High School ahead of tonight's big game. When Sykeston Bulldog fans arrived for the first game of the season, they will walk through these new metal detectors. School leaders say they're designed to make sure everyone is safe. There's no more taking metal objects out of your pockets. That's what fans can expect with Sykeston High School's new metal detectors at their football stadium. School Resource Officer Sergeant Tyler Rao says this latest security upgrade is a $20,000 investment. We use part of a safety grant in conjunction with the school to upgrade to what we call these open gate weapons detectors. He says local fans should start getting used to being screened before entering a game like this one. We get a lot of questions about well, why, why now and this? And, and if you really go to any new sporting event, if you go to Bush Stadium, you go to the Dome in St. Louis, you go to a uh, Memphis Grizzlies games, you're walking through uh, some sort of metal detector or weapon detector. Fans from both the home and away teams can also expect to be greeted by a school official and a officer before they can enter the stadium. It's not just for our people, but it's for anybody that wants to come enjoy Friday Night Lights. And he asks for patience from football fans as they work to get the hang of this new technology. Can I got it down at the field house, um, seeing that we started that last year with basketball games, but just give us a little bit of time. Sergeant Rao tells me these metal detectors will be used for other events after the football season is over. In Sykeston, Ahmad Lathan, Heartland News. This will be the normal procedure, we're told, for all future stadium and field house uh, events. Sykeston Public Schools says bags are still allowed, but will be checked at future events.